Dart Archer, we get the Rebel 135SS, shooting at speeds of 350 feet per second with a power stroke of 13 and a half inches, 180 pound of draw weight, 7.5 pounds of mass weight, 17 inches axle axle, and 32 inches overall length. All right, guys, what you just saw was uh, Kevin in the field shooting this bow. What was your first thoughts on this bow? Well, my first thought on it was how compact and comfortable it was to shoot. Um, it has a different feel to any of the other Dartons or, quite frankly, any of the other crossbows I've shot. Um, it's compact. I know I could easily use it inside a blind, which I really like. And I like the way that I'm right up over the top of the string and, and uh, just you know, looking down the... I know. think what the I think what people don't recognize yet about the Rebel and they're just starting to learn is that Darton, what they did is they actually changed the whole system of a crossbow. We're not looking at a normal crossbow here, everybody. We're actually looking at a handle, a grip that's been moved forward. It's in the center of the bow. And now your, your string actually comes back behind you. So it's actually underneath you. Whereas normally they come out and the string stops in front of you. That technology is not seen by anybody else in the industry right now. You can see how they did the Picatinny rail over the top. Just a great shooting bow, and did you feel that difference in the, the pivoting of this bow, the center? Yeah, I could really feel the comfort of just, uh, you know, sometimes, you know, using crossbows, as you know, sometimes they can be a little bit, you know, forward, top heavy, he top heavy or the balance is not right. The balance on this thing sings just fantastic. It's just, you know, you just locks in, and when you're, when you're on target, you just stay on target. And uh, I'm really looking forward to getting in some hunting with this yeah, crossbow. I think this is, to me, one of the most ultimate crossbows for hunting because it's so compact, right? so light. You know, again, the center of this bow, you know, you're holding it like this. Now, what, what you can't see uh, on the TV there is how narrow the grip is on the forearm and the, and the uh, handle here. It's, it's actually pretty narrow. Darton did a great job uh, of making it kind of thin. And it, so it feels compact. Not only does it look compact or feel compact, the actual ergonomics is compact, mm -hmm. which is really nice. <laughs> So, but cocking it was fine. The yeah, sound. cocking it, and, and you know, the one thing that I really like about it, like what I've liked about all the Dartons, is they didn't compromise on safety at all. If anything, this crossbow is as safer or safer than some of the other ones I've seen. You got the, the finger protection here. The safety is not a trigger lock safety. It's an actual safety that uh, locks the whole mechanism down so you can't misfire it and you can't, you know, Yep, have an it, accent with that. And correct me if I'm wrong, you gotta come up here, correct? To un, you do, to you have to, off. you know, it's a, it takes a little bit of practice. You're gonna have to get used to where it is, but once you get used to it, it's gonna be an easy adjustment and it makes it so much safer, it's worth, uh, worth the extra effort. Yeah, all in all, it's got that nice soft touch to it. Yeah. It's got the nice grip there. So all in all, very quiet from what I saw from the shots, you know, with the limb saver suppression on this thing. Um, it's flat shooting seems really accurate. I mean, I was, you know, letting them fly and uh, just locked right on. Of course, you have to, um, you know, the trick is not to aim at the same target point too much so you don't Robin Hood some bolts, you know, yeah. you want to make sure that you're... Uh, yeah, this one came as a package from Dart and they sent us with a uh, pull rope, the scope, um, the Black Eagle arrows, and the quiver. So it was a nice package ready to go out of the yeah. box. Um, take this thing hunting right away. You can uh, also change this piece, correct? If I forget. Yeah, you can change the distance on the stock. You can make it a you know to get, to get comfortable with it for you, whatever's comfortable with you. Um, they got the soft cheek piece there so that uh, it's quiet. You're not uh, 
rubbing rubbing up against uh, anything and you know I, I'm assuming I haven't used it in the cold too much but it, it it's it doesn't seem like it's cold on your cheek yeah I think everything about it's pretty warm actually <laughs> the soft yeah. touch here it's you know and then with that alone I think you're gonna be pretty good to go so all in all amazing product from Darton Archery the Rebel 135 SS make sure you go to dartonarchery.com to learn more about it um, and make sure you check out Tesla we'll bring you more great Darton things as time goes on thanks for watching